Hi, I'm Sherilyn, and today we're going to be replacing an upper agitator in a Maytag washer. You may need to replace your upper agitator if yours has been cracked or damaged. This repair should only take about 5 to 10 minutes. For this repair, we're only going to need one tool, and that's an extended 716 socket wrench. If you don't already have a new upper agitator, they are available for purchase on our website. Before repairing your washer, make sure that you disconnect it from its power source, and also turn off the hot and cold water. We can start by opening the lid. Remove the fabric softener dispenser by pulling up. You can set that to the side. Then there's a dust cap that we need to remove. Just lift up on that if you have one. Next we'll need to loosen the agitator bolt, which is a 7 16 bolt. We're going to need our long extension to loosen that. You may need to hold on to the tub for this as well. Once that agitator bolt is loosened, you can lift up on the upper agitator and dump out the agitator cam kit. Once we have our new upper agitator, we can place in the cam. Once that's in there, we can place the agitator bolt and sit it on top of the agitator base and replace your agitator bolt. And if you have a new fabric softener dispenser, you can replace that and that's it. You can close the lid. And we can turn on the water, plug it in and give it a test run. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you found this video very helpful. If you don't have any of the OEM parts and tools that you saw in the video, all of those products are available for purchase on our website. Our goal is to show that the everyday person is completely capable of cheap and easy household appliance repairs. So please like, comment, and subscribe to our channel, and maybe even show this video to a friend in need.